Hi everybody, thanks for joining me today. Let's go ahead and start on our next manicure. The first color that I have on my nails right now is obviously only one coat because you can see it's streaky, is this color from Fresh Paint. This one is called Island. Um, what I'm going to do next is use this one from Simple Colors. This one is called Boogie Nights. And I'm going to sponge that on using a small cosmetic sponge cut into a tiny piece and I'm just going to put the polish on and gently create a slight gradient just going maybe two-thirds of the way up the nail. Okay, I need to kind of let it dry in between because if I keep dabbing the tips it'll just start pulling the polish off and we don't want that to happen. So. Um, I'm going to let that dry just a little bit by moving on to the other nails. And then I might add a little bit more, just sponging a little bit more onto the, the tips. And then I'll come back and we'll do the next step. Okay, so here they are. And they don't have to be perfect at this point because we are going to be covering them with yet another layer of polish. And if you want to make them perfect and not do shimmer, that's fine. But because I like a little bit of sparkle in my life, I'm going to use this Zoya. This one is Rika. I'm just going to put a very thin layer of Rika over all of my nails. All right, so next what we're going to do is move on to stamping using Bundle Monster plate number 210. We're going to use this image right here. We're going to stamp that using this color from Sally Hansen Insta Dry. It's called Quick Brick. And I'm going to place that image so that both pieces will fit on my nail. Now, since my nails aren't super large, I have to shift it down just a little bit to make sure that I get at least some of the top on there too. There, if I tip it down, you can see a little better. Okay? So here it is, stamped on all the nails. And now we're just going to follow this up with top coat, my sesh feet. And here it is, the final look. I'm going to tip down so you can see how the red really does show up. It's just when you have light shining on it, you get that nice sparkle of color. This is actually a really good one for those of you who um, are trying to look for looks that will work for the office because this has a lot of personality and yet can still get by, you know, if you're looking from far away, it doesn't look too over the top. So that's it for this one. I hope you like it. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.